so much more to engineering than solving problems and fixing things. So what makes an engineer tick? Growing up, I love science. Experiencing firsthand the impact it had on the world and people around me, I knew early on that I wanted to get involved. There was always this great urge inside of me that strived for performance. But why did I become an engineer? To make something better than anything else, to break records, to go faster. I always pushed myself and my work to the absolute limit. Sport had always been a channel for this competitive edge. My desire to evolve my process and my practice. Being part of a sports team really taught me that some of the smallest changes are often the most important. How pushing yourself can excel an entire team to success. That feeling of wanting to be a part of a dynamic team environment, that's what drew me to McLaren. And being the company's first materials engineer, I'm so fortunate that I get to work on some of the world's most advanced materials. The changes that I make are really small. They're microscopic, but it is at this microscopic level where we make the difference. And it is here where we're able to make a lightweight car even lighter, and here where we're able to fine tune that product for performance. Working on some of the world's fastest cars makes me feel like part of a materials technology movement. And I want to use this platform to broadcast all the work that those materials engineers are doing on a microscopic level to better industry. For the young girls and boys who are looking to engineering for a career, wondering if it's quite right for them. But for me, more importantly, I want to use this platform to broadcast the work that engineers out there who are doing more than just safety and function. Why not take it to the edge? I have found engineering to be groundbreaking, beautiful, and I cannot wait to see where this winding road takes me next.